Houghton, and they think that it's a two-horse race here at the Meadowlands. Even money and super pleasure, two to one, and Charlie ten hits. And they're off. Three breakers at the start. Three breakers. Super pleasure went on a break. Also off stride. Grundy's mint. We now have four breakers. Five breakers. Only make believe has gone off stride. No commotion on a break. And spring affair. So the five still on stride as they move around the first turn. Off stride goes Crimson Lobel. Crimson Lobel has gone on a break. And now Charlie Tenhitch has taken a clear lead. Charlie Tenhitch now in front by four lengths. And it's Wall Street Banker now second by four. Giant Victory is racing in third position and Tyrannosaurus Rex. The remainder of the field have broken stride earlier. Super Pleasure, who broke right before the start, is now drawn within ten lengths of the lead. There's a wide gap back to the rest of them. Grundy's Mint also breaking their Crimson Low Bell and only Make Believe. And uh, then the farthest out are a Spring Affair and uh, well behind the field is no commotion. So they continue over toward the half mile pole and from the outside, now there goes Tyrannosaurus Rex to challenge Charlie Tenhitch and those two are on even terms and Super Pleasure has caught up to the top two. He's right there on the outside third toward the inside Wall Street Banker. They've gone a half mile in 102 and two and as the field rounds the final turn, it's Charlie Tenhitch on the inside, Tyrannosaurus Rex on the outside. Wall Street Banker's had a good trip so far. He's just in behind the lead. Super Super Pleasure up remarkably close. Then toward the inside, Giant Victory, followed by Grundy's Mint. They're moving toward the top of the stretch. It's still Charlie Tenhitch in front. And Super Pleasure is coming three wide now in a bid for the lead. Turning for home, and Wall Street Bankers just in behind them. Tyrannosaurus Rex has faded to fourth. They're coming off three quarters in 132 and one. And Charlie Tenhitch leads the way down the lane. Super Pleasure, a remarkable mile for this young two year old coming down the lane. And a stiff challenge for the lead. Charlie Tenhitch all out trying to hold off a brave super pleasure. Super pleasure's coming on the outside. Charlie Tenhitch, and here's the wire, and it is Charlie Tenhitch, and a remarkable performance from Super Pleasure to be second. A great victory for Charlie Tenhitch, a phenomenal performance by Super Pleasure. Charlie Tenhitch is owned by Washington Redskin lineman Mark May, who paid 20000 for him in training. Dick Williams, the second foot, did everything right, put him on the lead, avoided breakers, raided the pace, and stepped it up when Super Pleasure came after him. Super Pleasure had spotted the field about 15 lengths, lost all momentum, caught the field, and in the 28 and 2 last quarter, is flying right to the wire. An incredible effort. His price tag must have doubled even in loss tonight. Super effort from the top two. The fans had it right. You'll see more and hear more. And there's Mark May and his happy victory crew down there with Dick Williams II, who is the trainer.